limit 24 packs of Pokemon cards. In the product details, it says each assortment will have only one series and the selection is picked at random. Three out of five stars, two orders and 12 packs. I ordered 12 packs three weeks ago and got Rebel Clash. I just ordered another 12 packs and got Sword and Shield base set. Five out of five stars, Rebel Clash was what I got. Hope this helps others. Four out of five stars, I got all battle styles from 24 pack order. Not bad, but honestly, not what I wanted. Wish it was more random. Thanks. Five out of five stars, you will only get only Sword and Shield base set packs. I mean, I see some fates collide, see some Pokemon Primal Clash, Pokemon Evolutions would be nice. Yes, I would take Steam Siege. All right, 24 packs, add to cart. What is up, my breaking family? Send in some positive vibes in your direction. So while we're waiting for our family dollar Pokemon cards to arrive, I thought let's go ahead and open up some of the brand new, well, re-released Pokeball tins. Wait, you think I can juggle? Wish me luck. You got this. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Here we go as we dive right into today's Pokemon opening. Now these are the re-released Pokemon tins right here, the Pokeball tins with the Cosmic Eclipse booster packs. We're gonna open all these up while we wait for the package to deliver. Let's go ahead and start with some vivid voltage goodness. And we're gonna see if we can actually end up pulling, I don't know, possibly a rainbow rare. Pikachu VMAX, oh, Celebi Amazing Rare, going to an Electros for our other rare. There's the code card right there, but Celebi, welcome to the party. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon card section. Rebel Clash is up next, and we still need a few cards from Rebel Clash, so let's see. I think we actually need one of the shinies from it. We got Reverse Hollow Phalanx and Obama Snow. I don't want to see snow. That's the last thing I want to see. Energy! Ooh, Chat Tot, and Chat Tot's a bird, and uh, bird's got to fly, so fly away, bird, fly away. And there's the code card. Rocking and rolling right into the next booster pack, which is Cosmic Eclipse, one of my favorite sun and moon sets. Still need nine cards from this set for a complete set, and... Oh, we didn't get one, but we had a Zatu and an Ultra Necrozma for the Reverse Hollow. Oh, and a Rotom. And there's the code card right there. Whoosh. <laughs> Energy. Going into the regular Pokeball next. This one should have the exact same pack assortment with, oh yes, Cosmic Eclipse. And there is the coin, which is a Dragonite. I say we reverse it up a little bit and go with a Rebel Clash to start off with for our first booster pack in this uh, regular Pokeball 10. We got ourselves a Vulpix and a Scizor Scizor for the rare energy. Put that right back there in the filing cabinet. Code card once again. Vivid Voltage up next. Let's see if we can pull our first ultra rare of today's Pokemon opening. We got a Beldum going into a Wooper. Look at that, we're gonna do the same face. Here we go, one, two, three. It's like a YouTube thumbnail face. <laughs> Executor for the rare energy. And, oh, Shuckle Squad. Where are you at, Shuckle Squad? There's the code card. And Cosmic Eclipse up next. I love Cosmic Eclipse so much. We are going to do the card trick on this one. We haven't even pulled a hollow rare yet. These Pokeball tins uh, are treating us a little rough today. We got Woo Bat going in. I know. I'm not happy about it either. Energy! Araquanid done by my favorite artist, Tomokazu Kamiya. Draw energy, unidentified fossil, and oh, of course it's gotta be a Swana. And our last Pokemon 10 opening. We gotta get at least one hollow rare. These have been rough. All right, come on, Vivid Voltage. Oh, wait a minute, you hear that? That was the doorbell. Package is here. All right, we got, uh, oh, we got the the bubble wrap right there. But we gotta finish opening these up first and then we'll get to our family dollar Pokemon cards next. Very fast delivery they got. <laughs> Whismur, <laughs> Drillbur, it's like Amazon. That's, that's faster than Amazon. And an Ampros V Ultra Rare Goodness and Energy. We'll put that right back there. There's the code card. I'm laughing at my, my own segments here. Ooh. Rebel Clash is up next. The second set released in the Sword and Shield era. Volibi, all the way back early 2020. Surskit and a Galarian Surfetched Hollow Rare. This last Pokeball 10 treating us very, very well. Energy, 
And the code card, Cosmic Eclipse. Doing the pack trick on this one. Gotta build up that suspense for some Cosmic Eclipse goodness. We got ourselves a steel just rolling around, having a good time. Palpitoed, Jingma, oh, 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 oh. Energy, put that in the filing cabinet. I do have to show the filing cabinet at 1 million subscribers, so go ahead, hit that subscribe button right now. Become part of the Breaking Family. Oh, nice! All three packs had a hollow rare, or better, go into a hollow come oh 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 And the code card. Now remember, the Family Dollar site said it was only going to be one set. All of the packs would be from one set, and we got Sword and Shield base set, and I'm not upset at all. We are actually really close to completing the Sword and Shield base set. We just need a few cards left from this set, so let's go ahead and open up all 24 of these and see if we pull one. I'm gonna grab my Sword and Shield binder right back here. As you can see, my Sword and Shield Pokemon binder, I still need a few cards to complete the entire set. Now, Full Art Marnie is the most sought after card from the set. However, I am looking for this Rainbow Rare Snorlax VMAX. Let's get started breaking family. See if we can find that Rainbow Rare Snorlax VMAX or any other card that I need from the Sword and Shield base set. Fly away, bird, fly away. We got Choodle, Cottony, going into a Noctowl for the rare. And then, of course, we got Energy and the code card. Now, these came in bags of six, and uh, 24 was the purchase limit. So if you end up going and getting some on the Family Dollar site... Le oh, there we go! Secret Rare, Quick Ball, Breaking Family. Now, that is one of the best cards and one of the most playable cards that you could pull from the Sword and Shield base set. Woo, that's what I'm talking about. Nice. All right, Corvus Squire and the code card sign up. I mean, we already had one, but we got another one. Just gotta be careful. That can turn into a Pukamuku situation. Woo, talk about a Pokemon pull in the second booster pack that we open up from our Family Dollar Pokemon cards. We got Krabby. Going into a Nine Tails for the rare. Oh, Salazzle, once again done by my favorite artist, Tomokazu, code card right there. The awesome thing about Quick Ball is I have, uh, I definitely have a nice memory with the Secret Rare Quick Ball because that was my first, first like Ultra Rare or Secret Rare or uh, pretty much anything uh, more than a Hollow Rare that I pulled from Sword and Shield base set when I went to a pre-release tournament. Fix these up. So definitely has a special spot inside of my heart. Okay, going into the next booster pack, we have ourselves a Shelter, Rhyhorn, and another Ninetales? Wait a minute, is that our, that's our second one, right? Code card right there. I believe that's our second, yeah, that's our second Ninetales. Wait a minute, we pulled Noctowl, then Ninetales, then Noctowl, then another Ninetales. Hmm. Going into the next one. Whew, all right. <laughs> it's gonna be hard to, uh, hard to beat a secret rare Pokemon card with that Quick Ball. And a Professor's Research for the rare in that one. Code card once again. This next stack of six actually came from another bag. So I'm going to open them up in uh, in groups like they were sent to me in bags. So here we go. Going into the next one, we got Score Bunny, Galarian Meowth, and another Ninetales. My prediction is we're going to pull nine of them. See what I did there? Because nine and Ninetales, and it's, it's like the same... And, uh, no? No? I'm sorry, I thought it was a good joke! I know my jokes are cringy, okay? I can't help it. I think it's funny, alright? I'm not gonna apologize for being myself, having a good time, having a good laugh, okay? We got ourselves a Vulpix, Hoot Hoot, and a Galarian Obstagoon, a Hollow Rare, I'll take it. Energy! Put that right back there. And, oh, there's that Kingler. And there's the Code Guard. So one Hollow Rare from the second package. A Pokemon cards from Family Dollar. Nice uh, Family Dollar haul. And, oh, there's a Snorlax. Not the droids we're looking for, though. Code card. Need that Rainbow Rare Snorlax VMAX. Like I said, just a few more cards to complete the entire set. Citrus Berry and Indeedy V for an Ultra Rare and a Hitmonchan. I don't know. I, I think I like Hitmonchan better than Hitmonlee. You let me know. What do you think? Hitmonchan or Hitmonlee? Whoop. Two more packs left from the second bag of Pokemon cards from Family Dollar. We have Score Bunny, Krabby, 
and a Whimsicott. Whew, I kind of miss fairy Pokemon because that would have been a fairy Pokemon back in the Sun and Moon era. Energy! Last pack from the second bag. I wonder if every bag is going to have like one ultra rare. That would be really interesting to see if that happens. Uh-oh, breaking family. I already see something. So our, uh, our, what's the scientific term? Our hypothesis? Idea? I should have paid more attention in science. Either way, we got another ultra rare. Seeking and a uh, Delmise V for the ultra rare. Uh, almost said code card, but we got energy. Seeking the good pulls right there. We'll put seeking right there. Whoop. Six more packs from the next stack. And I just now noticed these are all Snorlax. They weren't, okay. Okay, the other stack is not all the same pack artwork either. All right, let's go into it. This was like playing a, uh, like a crane game, you know, where the claw comes down and it grabs something kind of at random. It was like a nice little Pokemon arcade situation virtually. Oh, Delmize V, full art. Whoo, did we need that one? Wait a minute, I gotta check the binder. There's the code card right there. Did we need this one? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Yes, this is one of the ones that we needed. All right, let's put it in the binder. Whoo, Delmize V, welcome to the party. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. This worked out really well for us today. This nice little Pokemon crane game arcade situation, which I don't think there was ever an actual Pokemon, like official, Pokemon uh, crane game ever made. There was, however, actual Pokemon arcade games made, and uh, I actually have a Pokemon arcade game. I'm talking like a legit arcade machine. I did a video right here on the channel that would have been in an arcade. Um, I did a video here on the channel. I will, uh, I'll link you up down in the video description so you can go watch that video or at the very end of today's video, I'll put a link as well, but check it out. It's really, really interesting. It's from the year 2000 or 2001, but this thing is massive. Do not ask me how we got it in the house. It took multiple people, but it's really, really neat. We got Rookity, fly away, fly away bird, live your dream, be a bird. Galarian Meow and a Claydol for the rare. And there is the code card. Notice anything about that clay doll? It's done by my favorite artist, Tomokazu. Energy. Into the next pack. Whew, I'm so happy we pulled that Delmize V. We needed that one for the binder. All right, so we are a one step closer to getting a complete set and a Wobbuffet. One of my favorite Pokemon going to a Wobbuffet Ultra Rare. Energy. Put that right back there. And the code card. Matches my shirt. And the last one from this uh, this bag group, and then we'll go into one more after that. We got All Wild the Mall Wild, Drizzile, and a Roserade for the rare energy in that one code card. Here is the last group, almost all Snorlax packs again. Let's actually, in what? Let's save Zacian for very last, and we'll start off with all of the Snorlax packs and this last bag of Pokemon cards from Family Dollar. Nice Family Dollar Pokemon purchase. And a Cramorant V. It is nonstop ultra rares in today's Pokemon opening. Whoop. Into the next one. The Pokeball tins started off a little rough. And then the Sword and Shield base set packs May, uh, made up for it, definitely. And a Thweevil that stole our Ultra Rare from the pack. How dare you? I know. It's a good day, Psyduck. It's a good day. I know. Just, can you be happy this one time? Just this one time. We pulled a card for a binder that we needed. No? No? All right. All right. Well, hey, we tried, right? We tried. Sinisty, Pikachu. Metal Saucer and a Galarian Rapidash, which there was a box released of Galarian Rapidash earlier this year. Third to last booster pack for today's Pokemon card opening. We got a Choodle. Will we? Oh, wait, we got that Cramorant. So we did pull an Ultra Rare in every single, right, every single bag? Right. And a Keldeo V, another Ultra Rare. What in the world is going on, Breaking Family? Whoop. How many Ultra Rares did we end up pulling? All right, after we open up this one, we're gonna see how many Ultra Rares we have pulled so far before we get into the last booster pack. We have Silly Cobra acting so silly and a Sincino for the rare. 
and the code card. Fix these up once again. We got one pack left. We ended up getting a Wobbuffet, a Keldeo, a Cramorant, a Delmise, another Delmise, Indeedee, Secret Rare Quick Ball, Ampros V, and that amazing rare Celebi. Whew, Quick Ball looks beautiful. All right, we got a nice variety right there. Let's go into the last booster pack, Breaking Family. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got. We got to do, we got to do the card trick on the last one. All right, here we go. We have ourselves a Pharaoh Seed going into a Chin Chow. We got a Score Bunny. Energy. Put that right there in the filing cabinet. Corvus Squire. Bird's got to fly, so fly away, bird. Live your dream. It's your life. All right, here we go. Reverse Hollow. Breaking Family. Code card. And we are ending on... Can I get a drum roll, please? Thank you. We are ending on... All right, you! You ruined the party! Yes, I bought an actual Pokemon arcade machine, and the winner got to go on a Pokemon card shopping spree. Watch it right there. Hit the subscribe button. I'll see all of you in the next video. And don't forget, I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.